Shampoo cycling also called as shampoo rotation. Well, what exactly is this? This is a process that takes care of the scalp hygiene and prevents buildup while making sure that the hair is also not getting dried out by using different shampoos in rotation. How does this work? Well, let's categorize the shampoos into three categories broadly. Number one is gentle cleansers, mild shampoos that you can use on a regular basis. So if you are somebody who is washing your scalp every day, this category of shampoos can be used on most days. So they are sulfate free, they have hydrating and moisturizing ingredients say like shea butter, glycerin, oils, etc. Um, the next category are shampoos that have sulfates that helps in little more better cleansing of the scalp and removing the buildup. They also have medicated ingredients say like zinc pyrethion, selenium sulfide, ketoconazole which have oil regulating properties, taking care of the fungus component of the dandruff. So they are medicated shampoos that can be used once in a while. And the third category of shampoos are shampoos that have little stronger ingredients that takes care of the dead skin cells and build up. Um, you know you have ingredients like coal tar, um, salicylic acid that help in clearing up the build up. So all these shampoos can be used depending on the scalp type you have, whether you have oily scalp or dry scalp, depending on the concerns you have like whether you have dandruff, seborrheic dermatitis, psoriasis or you have a normal scalp and you just want to take care of the build up at regular intervals. So why do I need to rotate the shampoos? Why can't I use a shampoo in any of these categories on a regular basis? Well here's the thing, so if you're using gentle shampoo regularly, this shampoo cannot entirely clear up the build up, especially the dead skin cells and the fungal component that is there as a part of your dandruff sitting on the scalp cannot be cleared uh, very well by a gentle cleanser. And if you use the cleansers that have salicylic acid or cold tar regularly, then it will lead to scalp sensitivity, redness, flaking, itching. This can also be an adverse effect of too much use of exfoliants. So it's always important for you to balance it out. Now, when you use anti-dandruff shampoos on a regular basis also, along with making your scalp dry, it also can make your hair dry, which is why it is very important for you to combine shampoos with good conditioners. So the shampoos can take care of the buildup on the scalp and the conditioners can nourish and protect your hair from drying out. If you want to understand how you can rotate your shampoos, read the description. I have attached a sample protocol on how you can rotate your shampoos based on your scalp concerns. Share the video if you found it informative. Follow for more skin and hair care tips.